tell you, I've been around some weird stuff, man. I've been around weird stuff. You think I'm joking? I have literally sat in those services where they literally were doing a tribute to Jimmy Buffett on the stage. And then they're like, you know, is, you know, it, it was that wonderful worship. And I'm like, what do you mean? I was just at a concert that was really bad. <laughs> it was just a really bad concert. Sunday morning up on the stage doing a tribute to Jimmy Buffett for worship, singing Margaritaville. Wasted away in Margaritaville. People are like, How much of the modern day church do we live according to the flesh? I'll, I'll, let, you, I'll let you know one of them. You know, I, I went to that church and I wasn't feeling the worship. It's just not my style of worship. Well, what's your style? Because even when they were doing Jimmy Buffett, I, would look, I was looking out the window going, God, you're so great. I was still worshiping. I don't, I don't need to have a certain team lead me. I can worship. I wasn't worshiping to Jimmy Buffett. It's an opportunity for me to worship the Lord. I'm gonna worship the Lord. I don't have to like the music. I don't need my a flesh appeal to you for worship. If I want that, I'll go to an ACDC concert. And then we come in and all of a sudden we want the music in the church to act like the world instead of it touching heaven. We're here to touch the heart of God. I'm not interested on whether you like it or not. How can we sing the same lyrics over and over again? I don't know until you finally get it. And shut up and sing it and we might move on. We're waiting for you. 